biggest land-based mammal in the world, the African elephant. Welcome back to me. It's Steph if you've just joined us. And we're on Juma Private Game Reserve here in the Kruger National Park with some elephant, a herd of elephant. Now this herd of elephant would all be related to one another and headed up by that big female that you see in the top left hand corner of your screen. She's what we call the matriarch. And matriarchs are all mommies. A patriarch is a daddy that is in charge of a herd. In this particular instance, elephants are headed up by a female. And here is a mommy and a baby. It's a young female, this, with a young calf. That little calf is probably around about six months old, maybe a little bit less than six months. And I would say that it's this female's first baby. She's quite small. She is probably as big as a minivan. And that's, that's in elephant terms for quite small. With that baby being about as big as... Oh, what can I say this baby is about as big as? Probably about as big as a full-grown sheep or a goat. Now what we're going to do is just sit very still. We've got the female approaching us. What we don't want to do is make her feel uncomfortable with our presence. We don't want to worry her in any way. She's got lots of avenues to walk in. What we want to do is give her the benefit of the doubt. Let's see where she goes. Now, elephants in the Kruger National Park, elephants in the Sabi Sands are quite tolerant of vehicles. They're not all tolerant of vehicles. I see she's actually damaged her trunk at the tip of it. She hasn't got those characteristic two fingers. Hello there, Mom. And that would be diagnostic. Hello, little guy. Hello. Very inquisitive, sticking his nose out. So that, that trunk of that mother that's only got no fingers at the tip, it's been damaged in a fire or it was bitten or something happened to it, she, uh, she, well, that would be diagnostic firstly, and apparently we see her quite often on drive. I think I've seen her once or twice before. She uses that trunk less like fingers but more like a club to hook vegetation. And as you can see, I mean, she's young calf, doing good. She's in good shape. Oh, look at that. Tail up, a little bit uncertain. If I start my engine, I just want to let them get a little bit further away. I don't want to give her a big fright. Let's see, there she goes. Now we can start the car and get